This is what the establishment doesn't understand. Many of them are here because of the conservative grassroots movement. Paul Ryan's speaker because of the Tea Party rallies in 2009, 2010. You know, they disregard us, I think, at their own peril. Paul Ryan is a Republican, so you would think he's representing us the right way. But with this um, bill that they're trying to pass, it doesn't seem like it's really representing us. I am sick and tired of them playing games. If you're a Republican, get on the Republican side. Get off the doggone fence. Nobody gets anything done there. I want a true, good, solid, standalone bill, uh, not one that needs amendments. So without further ado, Senator Rand Paul. Hey, guys. This bill is riddled from top to bottom with problems. What we want is freedom. We want to be free of Obamacare completely. I'll keep fighting. Hang in there. Senator Ted Cruz. Interesting kind of power play going on here between Rand Paul and Ted Cruz. Rand Paul feels like he's the leader of this repeal movement. Ted Cruz is jumping in on it, too. Ted Cruz is known for making a lot of trouble, and he's good at it. So he's blowing up stuff before. He looks like he's blowing it up again. We have a Republican in the White House. We have Republican majorities in both houses of Congress. How about we act like it? We've got to deliver on our promises. We need real repeal that lowers premiums, that gives you control over your health care. Thank you, and God bless you. When it comes to the health care debate and where we are right now, it reminds me of a line from your favorite movie, Never get into a, a land war in Asia. <laughs> Princess Bride, right? Well, and, and never go in against a Sicilian when death is on the line. There you go. This bill, if it goes to the Senate, it will not pass the Senate. Right. We've got to fix it now in the House. I think we're making meaningful progress. All right, yeah. see ya. See ya. See ya.